Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Uh, sorry I haven't posted uh, any videos here lately uh, in the last couple weeks. Uh, I took a little break uh, from kind of just from YouTube, like, well, f from, you know, content and trying to keep up week after week. Uh, I just, I kind of uh, had to take a break from it. So uh, I want to talk about uh, something uh, today. Uh, so uh, stick around and let's roll that intro. Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, like I said, um, I haven't uh, posted in a couple weeks. Uh, just kind of uh, took a break from uh, moto vlogging and uh, you know just motorcycle content in general. One of the reasons why I haven't um, recorded uh, in the last couple weeks was um, I just really haven't been, do been doing any riding that much. Uh, my wife's been busy. Uh, she's been working. Uh, she's on a work schedule now, working seven days a week, and um, I'm home with my son. And I just really haven't had the opportunity to get out on the bike and get really go for a ride. Any, I did ride uh, last uh, week or so uh, one day, and I was planning on recording that day, but uh, when I went to co-record with this. Uh, um, GoPro I have now that's attached to my helmet um, I forgot to put the memory card in it so um, well scratch that scratch that idea another reason why I also uh, wasn't able to record was if you notice this uh, mount right here well there used to be a uh, GoPro 5 that I have that used to set on that well uh, the story was I was going down the interstate uh, last week had that on there and um, I uh, was going along and I kind of caught it out of the corner of my eye it started you know wobbling a little bit well next thing you know it goes flying off and uh, It goes flying off and uh, luckily in the midst of all this I caught it with this hand um, or else it would have been uh, laying on the pavement somewhere and I'm sure stuff would have run over it and that would have been the end of that camera so uh, you know this mount that was on it was it was one of those hard shell cases that I've had with that uh, GoPro 5 I've had it ever since I bought it and I never would have thought that that case would have would have broke. Um, I guess just you know over time the the plastic gets brittle, and uh, you know it just it wears out over time. But you know to know my problem is to know when that when that plastic is gonna get brittle like that and it's just gonna wear out. That kind of that kind of irked me a little bit. That kind of made me upset um, about that. So. I think my plan is from now on when I get any kind of any kind of case or any kind of mount for these cameras I'm gonna make sure it's metal or aluminum uh, just to make sure because I have had some terrible luck with uh, these plastic um, you know little plastic case, uh, holders and the mounts and all that this I have a plastic mount on this camera I have right now it's a it's like a little it's called a j-hook mount it's a it, the mount on my helmet is called a chin mount and uh, it's got like a little j-hook that hooks on and I've went through a couple of those because I found that when you tighten them down a little too much uh, it'll one of the little uh, forks will, will, will break and I've went through several of those before and I usually just end up tossing them like you know after it breaks or after it gets a little uh, brittle I'll just you know throw it away and use the next one but you know that's it really bugs me that you just you get nickel and dime to like things like this that you know I want to get something that, that will last and that will not give me any issue um, 
and I thought this mount that was on this GoPro 5, like this case that it was, it was, I mean, like I said, I've had it for a long time, and I never would have thought that it would have uh, broke off like that, but, um, well, it just happened, so, but I am thankful that I was able to catch the camera, uh, was able to save it, um, yeah, and uh, I didn't get it on video, unfortunately, because, well, you know, recording just wasn't happening that day so anyway that's just a little quick video I wanted to make uh, about that and uh, it's uh, actually it's Labor Day weekend I uh, hope everybody had a great uh, Labor Day uh, I know we have um, my wife like I said she's been working the last couple weekends in a row uh, her work gets pretty busy this time of year so she's got another week or two to go and hopefully things will get it back to normal and uh, we'll kind of free up some of our weekends and all too. And uh, I'd like to get out and do a little bit of riding and uh, get back to doing a little bit of uh, moto vlogging and a couple other topics I want to talk about you know, later on, but we'll save that for another time. All right, everybody. Like I said, hope you all have a fantastic Labor Day weekend. Uh, thank you all for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Do me a favor and drop a like. Uh, leave me a comment and let me know what you think of these um, little plastic holders and this little plastic accessories that, you know, are all sold to these GoPros. And, you know, they just seem like they're pretty much all th throwaway products. And it's nice to get something that'll be pretty stable and uh, will last a long time. So. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. I uh, hope you all have a fantastic day, and I'll see you next time.